stop grabbing my thighs. I'm not doing anything. Stop. I just, just want to hug. You smell good. Yeah? Mm -hmm. I showered like two and a half days ago. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Jack Bream, and this is Gabrielle Moses. And welcome, welcome all to another episode of Embarrassing Myself in Front of a Camera. So today we're going to be doing a period talk video. Now, Gabrielle's wanted to do this for a long time, and I never wanted to for obvious reasons. It's disgusting. It's gross. It's weird. I don't like it. I feel like I feel like I'm not supposed to think of it like that, but blood is seeping out of your wang wang. And that's gross. I don't like that. So why the heck would we want to do a video about it? Well, I guess that's entertaining for people. Most importantly, girls, because that's like my demographic. So, I mean, it makes sense why we would do this and it makes Gabrielle happy and I'm whipped. So here we are. <laughs> so what exactly do you think a period is? What do you mean? Like, what do you think it is? It's when something breaks or like the, the skin tissue dissolves or breaks or goes somewhere or breaks in half or explodes and all of a sudden this blood just starts seeping out, right? No, that's not it. So pretty much like every month your lining and your uterus has to like get some new lining so it's healthy still. So it like peels off and like that's what you get cramps Yeah, right. what are these so hand motions? What, what does this tell me? It's and then it like peels off and then we do this and this and that. It symbolized like the peeling off. Yeah, peeling off. Peeling Here off. we go. So today we're gonna be peeling off this onion. Ah! Gabrielle, this does not mean peeling. It reminds me of the banana song. Wait, peel. Stop, banana. stop, stop, stop. Okay, so it's pretty much like the walls of your uterus coming out. So it's like self-destruct. Basically, the walls yeah, are coming down. Much. It literally feels like someone's taking their. Okay, tell me what you think it feels like. I'm not. I'm not gonna say it tickles because it probably doesn't tickle. But I'm not gonna say you're dying over here. Are you dying when it happens? It depends how bad your cramps are, but sometimes it feels like you are dying. Like nails on the inside of you, just scraping out. Yeah, but that's how I feel every time I take a crap. So I don't really know what the big deal is, okay? Like sometimes I'm taking a dump and I literally think like a honey badger's coming out of my butthole. So I don't really think this is that big of a deal. From what she's telling me right now, I'm not I'm not too worried about this. No, it hurts so bad. Like it hurts Gabriel, so bad. Honey badger. Bad. Honey badger. Have you seen honey badger claws? Have no, you seen I vicious? have not seen a honey badger. A honey badger. badger's a vicious thing. So I don't think we need to really dumb this down, okay? If anyone's in pain, it's me. How many times do you have your period a month? once, but it lasts like five days. Gabrielle, I take like a crap at least twice every single day and each one of those craps lasts at least four hours. That's not so, the same thing. That is not suffering? the same thing. That is not it the same thing at all. It is pretty similar from what you've told me. I don't know anything. You're you're, you're the one telling me this. I'm just taking No, it. it's literally Gabrielle, the, the harder you grasp my thigh, the worse this is gonna get. And sometimes you don't even know when your period's gonna happen, so I use this app called Clue. It's on iOS, Android, and it's a top-rated app by doctors. I really like it because it shows up in your notifications when your period is about to start. It gives you like a three-day, two-day, and one-day warning to when your period's gonna start. Think. God. There's also a calendar within the app that will tell you when your period's about to start and will give you notifications warning you when your period will start. The more information that you put into your Clue, the more accurate it will be and you can also share it with your doctor, friends, and family. Clue is accurate, has a simple, clean design, and is easy to use. Be sure to sign up for an account with Clue so your data is backed up and never gets lost. <laughs> be sure to check that out. There will be a link down below. They are sponsoring this video. No, it literally hurts so bad because you have these claws coming out of your stomach. There's blood coming out of your insides. Stop it. Okay, yeah, and you literally can't forget to like change your tampon, change your pad, or else you can literally end up in the hospital and you can literally die. I'm, I'm like, curious. TSA. Are you just like, are you explaining this to me or are you like warning the viewer of what like, No, I want you to feel to bad come. for me. I want you to feel All right, bad Gabrielle, for me. I'll sympathize for you, but later, okay? I'm sorry. Honey badger out of my butt. Okay, first thing, you're gonna try and figure out how to use a tampon. <laughs> No, wait, this is a tampon? Yes, that's a tampon. This goes in your vagina. Yes, that goes inside. What the heck is this, bro? bro. <laughs> this is weird. No, like, I'm not even gonna lie. Okay, yeah, we're here with this tampon sponsored by tampons.com. No, Gabriel, I don't think they care. It looks like... This, no, you did it wrong. It looks like a dog's wiener. Like, you know, whenever they get excited, it's like Red Rocket. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? You know what I mean? 
You know, if you have a dog, you've seen it. It starts like humping your pillow or something. So all of a sudden, like, what the? Oh wow, lift off. That's not even how you're supposed to use it. You're using it wrong. You have to click it. Gabriel, I'm pretty sure it's a weapon. You're supposed to say, bam, 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 bam. It got longer. Yes. It is a penis. No, listen. That's not okay. So tell me, how do you think you actually use this? You take it. I'm assuming. And it clicks. I, I, shh. Can I answer my own question, please? I'm assuming you put this in your vagina and then you insert it in like this and then you rip this part out, right? No, I was gonna show you better. Okay, anyways, this thing clicks right here. Okay. So it clicked. What is the clicking? Oh, so it clicks. So then whenever you push it up in there, it goes up further. And then whenever you're, it goes up all the way in, it kind of gets like stuck. And then you just pull this part this out and it's like up there. So basically what happens is exactly so what I just said. I this is what happens, ready? Hold still. Hell no, bro. You're Hold not putting this in my mouth. Yeah. Okay, a lot of people- All right, I've Gabriel, been here. Here, I'll, your I'll, nose. I'll put it in your nose. I've, no, I'll a lot of people- it. Gabriel, I did not sign up for YouTube to have a tampon put in my nose, okay? Yes, exactly. Give so we're going to put it up your nose. Okay, do it. Ready? So this is how is you Is it going to hurt though? No, like, it's not going to hurt. What if, it, like, people... what if it like touches my brain and I just like black out? Like it's just like, it's like, it's all of a sudden just goes and I'm just like. <laughs> no, 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 no. Okay. Whenever, a lot of people, whenever they have like. Can you look at the camera at least once during this video? I'm sorry, it's like I'm looking you're at you. lecturing me okay, the whole time. So a lot of people, whenever they have like bloody noses, they put tampons in their nose. Gabrielle, no one does that. It's also in She's the Man. That's a really good movie. Oh, okay. Everyone's seen that okay, one. Okay, now, right, now it makes sense. Ready? Yeah. Is it good? I'm afraid I'm gonna it's like... It's not gonna hurt. It's not gonna hurt. Gabriel, Ready? I'm not saying it's gonna hurt. I'm just saying it's gonna cause a lot of discomfort because of no, the it's not. going into my It's nose. not that big. It's like, it's like a lengthened cotton ball just going straight up my nose it's with not this little hurt. rat tail hanging out of it. I'm not into that. You can get scented tampons. Yes. How do you feel about that? Yes, I love it when my vagina smells like salmon. Okay, Gabrielle. Okay, just let Dude, me do no, it. it's flowers. I broke it? You broke it. Look at this. Gabrielle, <laughs> you're trying way too hard to be cute Wait, and funny. No, 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 it's just stop. failing. Look no, I don't want you to I, shove I wanna, this up I want to see nose. if your nose is big enough. No, my nose isn't big enough. My nostrils are huge, but once you get further in there, I've noticed because I pick my nose all the time, baby. Open wide. This went into my nose, and you're not freaking out. I don't understand that. Because <laughs> I thought you were putting that up my nose. No, I, I don't what care. This is. That's a thing. What is this? It is a blue wrapping thing of some kind. Am I supposed to open it, yeah, or is it going to like it. bite me? Okay. This, I would assume, just goes straight up your butthole. No, not really. This is probably, this kind of looks like the part, the middle part of a diaper, so I'm assuming this covers your little holio and just make sure the tampon either doesn't come out or if the blood does go out too much and the tampon doesn't compensate for that so it starts to seep out, this will catch it before you can like do something underwear. about it. Yeah. yeah. Good job, you knew. Gabriel, I use these like every week, okay? You think you guys think I get mad because I'm just like, no, yeah, I have my times. So the next product we have is right here, Jack. Okay, I know that Gabrielle, the little makeup guru inside of her soul, is like making it seem like we're sponsored by all these companies. So today, we're gonna be using this brush with this color palette. But no, okay, this isn't, we're not sponsored by these tampon companies, okay? What is, so I assume this is just the wrapping, so we get rid of that. No. So basically we have this. What is the purpose of this thing? Wrong part. Like, is it not my vagina or like? No, that's not what you. Oh. Uh, okay, so we got this diaper thing. And I'm assuming this has the about the same exact uh, use as the other mini tampon or mini band aid or whatever we had. So. Nope, different use. We use this before we go to bed and we cover our eyes so that's not bright out. Is that what we do? <laughs> no. Is that what we're supposed to be doing? Yeah. Pretty sure just ripped out one of my eyelashes. There's more to it. Gabriel, the more I look at it, the more I'm confused. There's, there's, there's nothing to it. It's a big old band aid. Right here. I'm assuming this goes on your vagina and the rest just goes up. I no, mean, they're really right anything special. This isn't some sort of rocket science. It's like Christmas. You gotta unwrap it, you see? All right, so now we got it unwrapped. And holy crap, I still don't know what's going on. Gabriel, what is the point of this? I don't know what it does. You're, you're sitting here waiting for an answer I don't have. What does this do? Okay, so this part right here, it goes around your underwear. So it'll, like, stay on better. And in case, like, blood gets around the sides, it protects it. Okay. I thought we were here to talk about periods, not learn how to deal with them, Gabrielle. That's not on my agenda. Just think about it. One day you're sitting in class and all of a sudden you feel it. Do you know what I'm talking about? That I can feeling. feel it. Sometimes there's just that feeling and you know it's starting. Yeah. And then you like move around in your chair a little bit 
and you can feel the blood. Like, can you feel it, Mr. Krabs? Think about it. You're just, are you feeling it, Mr. Krabs? Just think about are it. Are you feeling it, Mr. Krabs? You're just thinking. Are you feeling it, Mr. Krabs? Anyways, before Gabrielle can just continue to say things that are kind of obvious, we're going to end the video. I hope that you enjoyed. Be sure to check us both out on social media. Also, please check out her YouTube channel. It's dedicated to makeup. Y'all really seem to like those videos, but I don't like them on my channel, so they're going to be on her channel from now on. I'm sure occasionally some of them will be on my channel just in case I think they're extra spicy, but most of the time her videos will be going up on her channel. So be sure to check that out. A link will be down below. Be sure to check out the app Clue. I guess that's something that she uses. I don't use it because I'm a man. I don't have a vagina, but if I did have a vagina, I guarantee you I would use it. So be sure to check that out as well. Turn on our video notifications or you will die, but that's about it. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Jack Brayman. Welcome to another episode of Embarrassing Myself in Front of a Camera. And today, of course, we've also got the smegtabulin beautiful. I don't know where I'm going with this. Gabrielle Moses. So yesterday, we went and ate, and we got in a couple of fights, of course, as couples tend to do. And of course, she was being very annoying, and it was all her fault. 